see if they're in order. 63, 63, 53, they're not in order, so I'm going to do them by subject. There, now they should be in order. So this is 5.6, 53, 57, 63, 63, 69. All right, so 5.6, 53 slash 13. And I can guarantee you most of these are going to be test questions. Okay, yeah, that's a good test question. So let's go ahead and get my handy dandy Word document set up. Okay, I don't know why it does that. I click on the icon to bring it back up from the last class and it resets itself. Damn Russians. There we go. Them Russians, they get into everything. All right. Make that small. Bring it over. There we go. All right, so the first thing we're going to do is rewrite the problem. 63 million. Divided by. 700,000. Now, the non-scientific method is to do this. And do 630 divided by 7. And you can do that in scientific notation, but how many times will 7 go into 63? Nine times, right? Nine times seven is 63, isn't it? Y'all have to help me out. Nine times six, yeah. Nine times six is 54. So that'd be 90, which would be 9.0 times 10 to the first. Now let's see what we get and we do it by scientific notation. 63 million. Divided by 700,000. So top is going to be 6.3 times 10 to the blank. Let's see, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. And you need to move this to the right to get it back the way it was. Divided by. 7.0 times 10 to the fifth. One, two, three, four, five. And seven will go into 63.9 times. And seven minus five is two. This is not in scientific notation. 9.0 times 10 to the 2 blank 1. Which way did I move this in my head to get it back the way it was to the left? So your answer is 9.0 times 10 to the 1st. Two good ways to do this problem. You would be, does anybody have any idea why I show people this? Does anybody? Anybody want to take a stab at it? Why I show you this in a scientific notation section? It's faster. It's easier. Yes, both of those are correct, but that's not why I show it. Anybody want to take another stab at it? Step by step. That's, yeah, you could say that, but no. I show it because people graduate high school, they don't know that. I guarantee you somebody in here, you don't have to say it, but I guarantee you there's somebody in here that didn't know that you could cancel out those zeros. That's why I show it. Because I know people in college that start college and they do not know that you can cancel out those zeros. So 
it's another way of doing things. But the reason I show it is not because it's quicker or faster, even though it is. I don't show it because of that. I show it because I know there's somebody out there that graduated high school, whether it be 100,000 years ago, like some people think, or last June or July, that don't know that you can cancel out zeros. Okay, so that's a good problem. Non-scientific notation and scientific notation. Now, you could have done this different ways. You could have made this 63 times 10 to the sixth, and you could have done it like this. The law of exponents, which is scientific notation, the law of exponents dictate that you can do things several different ways. Do you come out with the same answer? Yes. Any questions on this one? Good test question, whoever sent it. Good test question. Next. And that would be to the first. And take out that decimal. And that should be your answer. Look over there, I got it right. I've, I did a good job. I feel good about myself. All right, let's delete that one. 5.6, 57 slash 15. Okay, list the numbers from smallest to largest. Okay, let's let's just uh, write them out. And I, I'm telling you this right now. This is not a test question I would pick up, but I haven't seen this question before in this class. So this is a new question. The second thing I want to tell you is this is 100% a standardized test question. I've actually seen this question on a standardized test. So I just want to let you know that. All right, 9.8 times 10 to the second, 2.1, 3.8, 4.1, 3.8 times 10 to the negative fourth, and 1.98 times 10 to the fourth. Well, I'm going to write all these like regular numbers. So 1, 2 is 980, 2.1, 3.8. I'm going to put a 3, 8 there, and I'm going to go 1, 2, 3, 4. And I'm going to put a 198 here. Oops. And that's going to be 1, 2, 3, 4. So we've got this one's the smallest. So 0 0.0038, 2.1, 3.8, 4.1, 3.8. Uh, that's from smallest to largest or largest to smallest, whichever one. Oops, I'm sorry. I suck. There we go. So I changed that to 980. This one I didn't have to change. This one I changed to 0 0.0038. And this one I changed to 19,800. So if you're going from smallest to highest, or if you're going from largest to smallest. So what does it say? Let me move this over. It says from smallest to largest. So we're looking for 3.8 first. Where's 3.8? OK, so it's either Charlie or Echo. So let's look at the next one they got. 9.8, we got 2.1. So I believe it would be Echo. 